Hey, what's good guys? I want to touch on here. In today's video, I have a requested video by you guys, which is how to get some of the iOS 7 features on your iOS 6 device. And you do have to be jailbroken dude, to get these features. Um, I, in my previous video, I showed you how to get the theme, the iOS 7 theme, and then a lot of you wanted to learn a little bit more and how to get the features of iOS 7 on iOS 6. So I'll show you guys how to do that in this video. The first thing that you guys are gonna to wanna to do if you haven't already done this is download two themes. Number one is the iOS 7 theme complete. Just search that in Cydia. And the other one is iOS 7 bars and battery. Download both of those and then open up Winterboard and uh, make sure they're selected. I would not download the calculator theme because it doesn't work. But uh, the next tweak that I'm going to show you how to, what to download to make it look like you're running iOS 7 is blurred NC background, which gives you this effect right here of when you pull it down, it kind of blurs the background and it's transparent. That is a feature that is on iOS 7 and worth downloading if you want to convince people you're running that on your iDevice. The next one is a paid Cydia tweak. And uh, to download this, you guys are gonna to wanna to search for card switcher. And what happens is when you double tap your home screen button to uh, open up the multitasking stuff, you get this which looks almost identical to the iOS 7 version. And if you ever wanna remove applications, you can swipe it up or hit the X. It looks very similar to the iOS 7 multitasking. The next tweak is pretty cool. It's called Deep End. I've made videos on this one before. I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but if you take a look at my background here, it is moving with how my iDevice is moving. Um, and the back, it, this isn't the best background to see on camera, but the background is moving. It gives it this really nice, almost 3D effect. And that tweak is called Deep End and it is free. Next, Thing you guys are going to want to download is the font. So as you guys can tell, I have a little bit of a different font going on right now uh, on my device. And to do this, you need to download Byta Fonts, which is B-Y-T-A-F-O-N-T-S. And then you're going to also want to download the right font involved with this, which is Roboto Lite. So search for those two things in Cydia. And by the way, everything will be in the video description down below. If you need to add any sources or just uh, the names of different tweaks to download. So make sure you look in the description down below there. But that's the um, font right there, Roboto Lite. Make sure you have it enabled in all of those categories. When you open up by the fonts, as you guys can tell, I've set it for Roboto Lite in all of them. That's all you wanna do. The last tweak I'm gonna be showing you guys is Folder Enhancer. I don't use it really, but you can make it look like you're running on iOS 7. Um, you can also change the color of the background and make it transparent to make it look more like iOS 7. Well, that's it for this one, guys. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.